Hey, what's up guys? This is Sal and you're watching TikTok TV. One of the biggest disappointments in the Galaxy S8 has been the rear mounted fingerprint sensor and that's not going to get any better in the upcoming Galaxy Note 8. But according to Ming-Chi Ko of KGI Securities though, there's a light on the horizon. Ko is a reputable analyst who has a decent but not quite spotless record when it comes to these things. He predicts in a new report that Samsung will stick with the same rear mounted fingerprint fingerprint sensor on the Galaxy S9. While that's a bit disappointing, we can hope that Samsung listens to customers feedback and adjust the position to a more economic location. However, Samsung is reported to be making its first smartphone with an under display fingerprint sensor in the Galaxy Note 9. The report says that Samsung has no reason to risk the technology in the S9 since the upcoming iPhone 8 has ditched the efforts to implement it. Seeing that mass production level options are coming soon, it's clear that Samsung has good reason to bring that technology to the Galaxy Note 9. KGI further reports that Samsung will switch from Synaptics to Aegis at the time of Note's release to supply the company with fingerprint sensor on the Galaxy Note 9. It's also important to note that the switch to this technology is not a simple one as the cost of that sensor is estimated to be 4 to 5 times as expensive. Obviously, we're still quite a ways out from learning more details about Aegis either of these smartphones, but if KGI's predictions are correct, it's looking great for Samsung's 2018. So that being said, let me know what you think about this in the comment section down below and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Joanna Jędrzejczyk.